getting breakfast at Hole in the Wall. Film this because oh my god, the amount of food. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Yum. <laughs> Okay, so we are doing like a crazy hello. <laughs> this is Pin Cannon. Great. Oh, here go. And hello, like a food resupply. Uh, what would we call this? Hello, Shuba. Food and snacks and everything. We're like sharing all of our resupplying. Yeah, it's like a food explosion here in this hotel room. <laughs> So we've gone to a restaurant and we decided to get margaritas, but look at the size of these. <laughs> Wait, how much cool. is Cool. Wow, that's awesome. Yeah. Good for you. They yeah. meet a lot of cool people. Too. Oh, yeah. yeah. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. Uh -huh. So we just came back to mountain crossings, left the cabins and now we are hiking on. The plan is to go maybe around 10 miles today and um, there might be some thunderstorms and rain later so we will see about that but yeah we're just about ready to leave. And I bought some sock liners and uh, like what do you call that? Electrolyte mixes from the store, so I'm all ready to go. So we're leaving Neil's Gap now, saying bye to the shoe tree. We did not leave our shoes here. We're ready to walk on. And actually this apparently is the only place in the trail where the trail goes like inside a building. So that's interesting. All right. So onwards to Maine. By the way, I have a trail name now. I actually got it the day before yesterday but I just haven't had time to tell it. So my trail name is Firefox. And it's a bit of a long story, but it has to do with the fact that I'm from Finland and in Finland we have the Northern Lights and the Northern Lights in Finnish is Revontulet and that means Fox is fire. And then I was kind of undecided I had some other trail name options as well but the thing that finally decided it was that when I came down from Blood Mountain and I had rented that cabin for us New York had gone ahead and got the key and then when I came down he was like you never guess what the name of the cabin is because all of the cabins are named after an animal and the name of our cabin was Fox so I was like okay I guess that the, that's the trail's way of telling me that Firefox is a good trail name for me. So hi everyone, I'm Firefox. So we're walking on like a ridge line. There's just a, well, 
there's just fog <laughs> in both directions, but looks kind of cool. Look, there's this caterpillar or something. It's, you know, wrapped up around itself. It looks so spooky. We're going into the gray mist and gloom. We put the rain stuff on, but then it stopped drizzling. So I don't want to take them off because if I take them off, I'm sure it will start raining again. this misty view of the mountains wow that looks awesome So we climbed that mountain there, then we walked all the way to the gap that you can't really see. And now we've been climbing all the way back up this and it is still going. I don't even know how far. It's a, it's a day of big climbs, big ups and big downs. Well, I guess that's every day, every day here on the AT so far. I think we're coming down to Hogben Cap Gap. Jeez. Hogben Cap. <laughs> okay, a gap. But look at all these switchbacks going down, down, down. <laughs> There's been a lot of switchbacks today. So we're getting closer to the low gap shelter. There's a storm coming tonight, like thunder and uh, rain. It's going to, I guess the storm is going to go through. So we will see what it's gonna be like. But I know there's gonna be a big group of us camping there. So maybe there will be safety in numbers. But it's been another kind of long day or at least a tough day. So many like big climbs up and down. Uh, I'm feeling kind of tired already. I think it's gonna be about 12 miles that we will do today. We're almost, we're getting closer to the shelter. So yeah, a tough day, but a good day. So we have like a little tent city over here. Everyone's set up. We tried to put our tents 
nice and tight for the possible thunderstorm. It's looking quite good for now, but apparently the rains are coming like after 11 and during the night and maybe in the morning. So we will see what it's going to be like.